What seems to be the problem, Brian? You see, Matt, I just don't understand a subjunctive form of German. Well, let me see if I can give you a hand. You see, Matt, I understand the word order. I just don't understand conjugation. Well, I understand conjugations. I just don't understand the word order. Well, maybe we can learn together. together. In German, the subjunctive form is used when direct quotations are not desired. Oh! Subjunctive form is what we like to call indirect speech. Ach ja! The subjunctive form relays what the speaker has said, but not with direct quotation marks. Now I understand. A direct quotation would be, I'm satisfied with it. But a subjunctive indirect form would state, he says that he is satisfied with it. Oh! Subjunctive indirect form is used in serious reporting, such as newspapers, magazine articles, books, television newscasts, and reports. Sehr gut! Please pause the video now for further instruction. Ach, Tom! When reporting in past tense, in German, you must translate whatever tense it came from into the present perfect form. Sweet, bro. If the direct quotation is in the present form of indicative, the subjunctive form must also be in the present form. So that's the subjunctive situation. Achtung! See, Brian, it says here that the present tense of subjunctive form is formed by adding the following subjunctive endings to the infinitive stem of the verb. E, E, S, T, E, E, N, E, T, and then E, N. Ooh. Note that subjunctive one forms never have the stem changes. Changes found in some of their present indicative counterparts. The infinitive stem is used throughout. Whoa! Whoa! Awesome. Whoa, look at that! S is heist. S is uber heist. Yeah. The only exception is the verb sign, which has no endings in the first and third person forms. The subjunctive conjugated forms for the verb sign are as follows. Ish, sigh, do, sighest, er, see, sigh, beer, sion, ear, sighet, un, see, sion. All this German's making me hot. But that could be a good thing. I kind of like it. Now I'm flying through subjunctive. I'm soaring high with the word order and the conjugation. Hope you've enjoyed the ride.